Hey everyone, got a mail day video today. Gonna go over some of my recent pickups and my thought process behind these and share my strategy moving forward with these, these pickups. So um, let's go ahead and jump in. Uh, but first of all, if you're new here, welcome. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if this is um, helpful for you. I primarily do raw to grade. Um, this video might be a little different though, so we'll, uh, we'll see how this goes. So these are two lots that I picked up off of Facebook um, at really good prices. And I've been starting to do this a little bit more and I'll explain why as we go through the cards. So this first one is um, mostly Anthony Richardson, a little bit of Stroud and a little bit of uh, Bryce Young. So we got some cool stuff. Leaf three out of 30 some absolute numbered stuff. Yeah, I mean, it's it's nothing too high end, but got a couple of these thicker jersey cards. Um, I paid 70% of comps for this lot. Um, I'm happy about the price. And so kind of my thought process behind this, a lot of this thicker stuff that I'm showing you I was not expecting to be gradable. Same with a lot of this cheaper stuff. I wasn't planning to grade this, but getting it at 70%, it allows me to be a little bit more picky with what I send in because um, since my buy-in cost is lower, I can resell these raw and still make a profit, if that makes sense. So, um, yeah, so nothing too crazy, just some, some lower end stuff. We do have some nicer prisms. Um, so got a really good deal. I think I paid, I paid, let, let me think, 400, I believe. Yeah, I paid 400 for this lot. Um, and there's a couple bigger cards that, you know, definitely justify that price. The leaf, the leaf card is going for 90 or so right now. Um, these, these, you know, prism color are decent, you know, 30 to $50 in some cases, and a lot of cheaper stuff that I'll be able to resell raw and make some money on. So, um, my, uh, so a couple things I've been starting to do this cause I've been getting outbid a lot more on eBay. And also I've been starting to do this to buff up my own eBay store. I want to be able to eventually run auctions on my own eBay store. Um, so I, I want to get more feedback and things like that first. So this is the perfect way to do it, buying lots um, and then selling them for a profit while getting more feedback. So I've actually already gone through this lot and these are the ones that I'm for sure going to be grading. These all look really clean. There's a couple more that I'm on the fence about. Yeah, we got the Stroud, red, white, and blue. There's a couple more that I'm on the fence about, but my thought process is all of these, I'll probably be able to break even selling all of these raw and then get these ones graded. And, um, you know, it's just icing on the cake other than that. So um, I'll be able to build up my eBay store in the process. Um, it is a little bit more work, definitely, listing more cards, you know, shipping more cards, but I think I'm to the point where I'm really trying to level up and step up my, my business, so I'm, I'm open to some new avenues um, of doing that. So there's the first lot. Really happy with, with that overall. I honestly, I wasn't expecting really anything to be gradable. I kind of just expected the worst. And worst case scenario, I resell it raw and just take some profits. Um, and this lot, um, I haven't gone through this one yet, but this is an Anthony Edwards lot. And my thought process behind this is I, I probably will resell most of these raw, even if they're gradable, because I'll likely be able to buy them back in a couple months and get them graded um, for cheaper, unless he you know, goes on to win the title, but um, w which is possible but I think I, I will probably sell most of this stuff raw unless it's really, really clean. But I bought this lot for 60% of comps. I paid 195 for this lot. 
and we got you know the two base prisms some select stuff again nothing too crazy but um you know it'll add up and again you know this is a lot more items i can sell i can just auction them off and i'm pretty confident that i'll make profit just by auctioning them off and get more feedback get more items sold and make a profit i'm hoping to to sell i'm hoping to get about hopefully 300 net for this lot so make about a hundred dollars profit for this lot and then yeah like i said with this other lot um i'm on the fence about a couple more of these i may grade like this one here it looks really good but optic is just a tough grade this year um so i have to decide on those but I'm hoping to break even with the raw stuff I sell and then any graded stuff is just icing on the cake. Yeah, so I might grade stuff like this if I if I look over it and it looks really good. The optic base too, it might make sense um, to grade a couple of these, the ones that look the best. So um, optic from this year is a lot easier grades than, uh, sorry, optic from Anthony Edwards year is a lot easier than this year. Mosaic base, like I got really good prices on these. So, um, yeah, I mean, he's hot right now, so I'm going to be listing these ones ASAP. The Anthony Richardsons and the, the others, I have a little bit more time on because I think their prices are going to build up a little bit in, in, you know, as the season hype begins. But with Anthony Edwards, I want to get him out of my hands as soon as I can. So yeah, just, just base mosaic stuff and then a, a color at the end. So I might grade this one too. Um, yeah, so the, the thing I'm learning about this is it, it gives you some options. If you can get these lots at 70% of eBay comps, which not everyone wants to sell them at that price, and that's okay, that's, that's fair, you know. Um, but there's a lot of people who don't want to list these on eBay and take the fees. They just want to get rid of them um and and a lot of them will, will do really good deals for bulk prices and it really like i said it opens up a lot of options you can resell the whole lot raw and probably make money um you can get stuff graded that makes sense to get graded sell the rest raw which is kind of what i'm doing and overall i think it's it's a new piece that i'll be adding to my strategy at least in the short term um so we'll see how it goes. Stay tuned for future videos. I'll probably make another video after I sell through these to give um, financial uh, breakdowns, which will be fun to look back and see. So thank you for watching. Again, please subscribe if you haven't yet. Please like the video as well. I'll be doing a giveaway at 1,000 subscribers. Uh, so make sure to stay tuned for that. And we will see you guys next time.